and let us sing. Come and let us sing. Come and let us sing. Come and let us sing. To the King of Kings. Come and let us sing. Come and let us sing. Come and let us sing. To the King of Kings. Enter his gates. Enter his gates with thanksgiving. Enter his courts with praise.
his glory. Yes. And as we praise him, he does amazing things yes. for us. Yes. He shifts our attention and our focus from all of the things that we're worried about, for all of the things that we're concerned about, as the angels are working on our behalf. That's who we're worshiping this morning. The God of the universe, who has angels dispatched on our behalf. Who can we worship in this morning? You know, we can't see what's going on behind the scenes. But God is working, people. His word says that he is working. And it's our duty to praise him even though we don't see it. Because we know it's coming. Because he is the God of the universe. Can we sing that several more times? And if you can't come to the altar, make an altar in your heart. There was such a sweet presence of God here this morning. And our prayer was that you would experience it the same way we did. Because you are a brother, you are a sister, and God is no respect of a person. What he did this morning, he wanted to continue to do in our midst this morning. Will you make an altar in your heart for the King of Kings? For the Lord of Lords. Oh, he's working. Can we continue to sing? Oh, come to the altar. Yeah. <laughs> 